welcome back to another video. I haven't uploaded something in a while, so I thought I might as well do an update. We've started building a new layout, that being me and my dad. So, ob obviously it's on DCC, but we've got to wire it up for DCC to be controlled by one controller and not multiple, so it's been a lot of pulling up the track again and re-isolating and wiring. It's getting there. There's still things that need to be done, but it's not quite fit yet for reviews. I do have some engines that I haven't reviewed yet that I should review, but the current state of this layout is just... Yeah, this is a wreck now. There's no point. And this isn't in a fit state for reviews yet, so, yeah. But the balancing has been going fairly well. It's dry now, this bit. Uh, yeah. So that's well, but we haven't done anything else apart from that siding there. There will be a full video when we get all the ballasting done here. In terms of DCC fitting engines, there are five more that have been fitted with DCC, which is great. The W4 Pecket, whose decoder arrived three days ago, three, four days ago. The Hatton Speed Class, the Hornby J50, and the Hornby J15. The J50 isn't completely operational yet. Um, it needs a bit of work to it to get the decoder to work but I ran out of sticky tape before I could get it to work, which is painful. And we still haven't got some yet, so once I get that, that should be working. Maybe. All the other times we tried fixing it, it didn't work. We'll get there eventually. Uh, here is the two new engines. The four MTs fitted with DCC, that being this engine, and the Machman ROD, is not, but I do have a Dakota coming, as I do for the Backman Prairie and Hornby Terrier, so that should be really good. And don't listen to what people say, big engines can go on first radius curves. This is a ROD 280, so quite large, and there it goes, quite smoothly around first radius so don't listen to what people say in terms of where the rest of the engines are some are packed up in the closet well most of them are um packed up in the closet and a few are on display but there's not much running happening and i'm not sure when the ballasting video will come out but it'll come out sometime I hope everyone had a very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Um, goodbye.